Alright guys, this is uh, Eternal Dragon Games, gonna give you the lay down on this video. Alright guys, uh, this is basic. This is not really a tutorial, this is just moves that would allow you to land Atomic Blast. Because it's a really badass move, I like it, other people like it. I know some people think that it should be a stamina break move, but... Nah, after this video, it's not. Just be a lot of people are probably gonna start trying this now. Uh, first is gravity impact, which uh, it's, it's kind of obvious, just like the second one. You just activate any super key blast move after this, and it, it should land. This is why it's on this list. Alright, as soon as I get some muscle stops, I didn't like a bitch. Okay, next, if you see my previous videos, you should know that uh, super dragon flight. If you're all the way up in the air, we'll kind of freeze the enemy. And it should land. Alright, uh, this next one is Ice Claw, which is really hard move to land. Uh, but it's kind of, uh, you can kind of land it if you uh, trick the computer into thinking that you're still going to use your combo so they won't teleport. It's just, it's just I use a female saying, as soon as you get the third hit in, you just activate it. Next, we have Meteor Blow and Meteor Strike. So you're kind of going to want to hold to two counts on the Meteor um, Atomic Blast for it to land. Which, uh, I didn't really have the computer on, so I had to redo this. I also did a Spear Bomb. But, uh, it did land, but Spear Bomb, I wouldn't really recommend. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this is when I uh, tested it with the computer on to see if it would land. I tried meter blow, I didn't really want to try both moves. Let's see, next is Super God Fist, which uh, you kind of want to do a land, um, let me see, a wall bounce, I'm not 100% sure if you have to. And you also need to be behind your enemy, I don't know why it doesn't work if you're facing them. So you just activate the move, you can just, just activate uh, Atomic Blast right afterwards, don't do the two counts. Next is, uh, this actually kind of surprised me, it's just a cross arm dive, which you can't really activate if you're all the way in the air, which you should take note of. But as soon as you land cross arm dive, you can activate it right afterwards. Uh, this is where I read the spare ball with the computer on, which as I said, computers are, are really going to try to dodge this move. Uh, I guess I kind of got lucky. Computer didn't attack me midway. All right, and uh, thanks for watching. Uh, like, subscribe, and uh, share this video with anyone that you think would want to see it. All right, thanks.